Yo, yo, what's up, Bad Bad? What's up, Two? And Bad Wolf, I sent a video. I'm gonna do this for y'all. Okay, I probably do, you know, a story about the late uh, actor, Lamont Bentley. Yeah, he was, um, you know, actor. You know, um, yeah. He, was, he played a movie in the hood, you know, a couple of uh, shows in the past couple, couple of years, you know, he was on um, the actor, but because if y'all talk about his life and career and his death, so here we go. Okay, my Billy was born in um in I say in Rockland, Wisconsin. And so he was, you know, a rising actor, so uh and so he played like you know, like movies and stuff, but um I said when we were young, you know, his mother um was a um singer. And so I think they had um had moved to California though, you know, when he was young to where you know, she tried to like focus on her career and so I think his um life was based on you know um based on only trying to become an actor so uh yeah I believe he went to California to start his career and uh, how his mother you know want to start her career I think her family had went to you know to California to move out there and um uh, and so I think it wasn't easy to where you know you trying to get actor on uh, get first at first you know he had to get a job. And so I think he first he had dropped out of school, you know, and, and so I think, yeah, first, like, yeah, the first year, uh, I kind of dropped out of school to become an actor, so, you know, he had to work, you know, to get a job, so, yeah, I think he had work, uh, you know, at a, um, you know, fish market, you know, he, um, so, let me see, I think I worked there at a, um, you know, at movie theater, I think, so I think he had, you know, I say he had to work. To get ahead, so I think he had to, um, you know, work, you know, get some money in his pocket. But as I think he started, like, you know, getting his first acting job, you know, at, um, probably in a, a commercial that he did, in, um, in the past. As I think he started this, um, this, this called the Starburst commercial, um, so they started his, this, um, Commercial called the Star uh called the um uh, Starburst commercial, and so I think he um you know uh about that gig his first gig you know to where you know he started in his commercial, and so I think his first big uh, role was in a television series called um South Central with um with Tay in the show, and so after that. You know, he featured his uh, first big role in a movie called Tiff in the Hood. And so, uh, to we play as the actor, um, Crazy K. And so, I think he started getting his first big, um, you know, other roles in this show called Maisha, you know, which is a hit show you know, on the show, uh, on UPN show called Maisha back then. And so, I believe that this show... I said, what's a major hit you know, to where, you know, it's more show that, you know, been well known throughout the day. You know, I think this this show is a, you know, show featuring um, Brandy. And so I think this show uh, that he played as um, Moesha's um, friend, I guess, as a uh, Hakeem. And so I think he started, like, you know, getting a lot of, you know, I said, like, roles in movies and shows and stuff. So um, when he was, you know, alive, but, and so I feel like, you know, you know, he had a good major short little career, man, to where, you know, he started to get, you know, a lot of, um, you know, I, I started, like, teaching in Hollywood, and so I feel like, you know, his own um, short little career was, you know, him trying to become an actor, man, how, you know, I think he's trying to make it, you know, in Hollywood. It's not that Hollywood is, is, you know, it's kind of of tough business being, you know, especially if you're an actor, rapper, man. It, so I feel like, you know, Hollywood can be a tough, uh, tough place to be, you know, to, you know, to where, you know, we try and be a rapper or an actor, but, for, and so I feel like, you know, his own life was basically trying to, like, achieve more stuff, you know, to where, you know, he started to be a rapper, and so I think he started to be a rapper, um, before, uh, I said right after, he became an actor, I think, and so I think, and so I think he's trying to, like, uh, try to, uh, you know, get to more with rapping now. You know, I feel like, yeah, I do think that 
he's trying to get to more to uh rapping, you know, to more devils in life to where, you know, he trying to cheat being a rapper, but so I think he wanted uh let me see, I think he, let me see, I think that he was in group two. Yeah, I think he, yeah, I believe that he was in group before. I think he had uh made his first group. So I think he started like you know, rapping in the group. So I feel like his own life had chief, but uh and so I think he started like, you know, getting more involved in, you know, you know, charities and you know I just get back to the community though, you know. That's where he's from. And so I think Lamont Bingham was a great actor, man, and you know, a good person to where, you know, his family had knew, you know, I just kind of had knew him as a you know, good person to his family, to some town he's from, man. But I feel like, you know, the more people might know him, you know, the more, you know, that he had good heart for people, though, you know, for the kids. For adults, people that was older than him, I feel like his life is basically trying to get back to the, you know, you know, I said to his other people though, you know, to where, you know, uh, yeah, I probably said that, you know, uh, I probably said that he was a good influence on people, so, but, um, man, on tragedy, man, on 2005, man, how, you know, his life had ended more, more brutal, man, how, Okay, okay, back when I was five, uh, you know, I think he, that he was driving in um California with um problem with problem at midnight to where you know he was driving in his car and how he had like heck uh first you know he was driving in high speed you know on the highway to where you know like uh I mean so I believe that he was driving so fast and how the car had went went through the gate you know and how. You know, he had tried to get himself out of the car and how five cars had struck him, you know, and how he was killed, man. But, and so, I think that five cars had killed the man while he was, like, trying to, um, you know, trying to, I still got the road and how five cars had killed him, man. But, so, I feel like his life had ended so brutally, man. I feel like, you know, his life was, basically, I said, give the courage, you know, to where, you know, he was the actor in the rise and how he got killed, man, in that um, crash, you know, how the car had struck him, man, but, and so I feel like his life had ended while he was, you know, you know, living, but I feel like he died, and so I feel like he died while he was 31 years old, and so I think he left behind, um, so I think he left behind a daughter, I think, a daughter, you know, baby, while he was living, but, so I think he left Behind daughter and he, you know, he, you know, and he does affect his family, his uh, his friends, his castmates, man. But so I feel like you know his acting career, um, will be known by playing Tiffany in the Hood, you know, at Crazy K, man. But so, so I feel like you know his life, you know, and his death had affected his family, man, on how his family felt like. He is going to miss, you know, for his work and you know as an actor and how his actor um career had blossomed throughout his own career, man. But I feel like his own career went went you know full fledged until he you know been an actor. But so so I said that he so I probably said that his life was going to be missed by his family, his friends, his castmates, everybody. But so yeah, I say you know I preach to the actor, man, the my business, so. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to peace. I'm out here. Take care.